Sellers, the four things you need to do when receiving a lowball offer. Number one, look at the offer, ask yourself, is this really a lowball offer or is it just less than we wanted? But revisit those numbers and make sure that your asking price is in line with market value and so are your expectations. Number two, do not immediately reject the offer. Some buyers are going against their buyer's agent advice and they're just trying their offer. Remember, this is a conversation starter. So keep the conversation going, counter and keep your end goal in mind, which is to sell your home. Number three, consider all terms and conditions. Obviously, price is a big factor when you're selling your home. That being said, are they offering a quick close? Are they offering a rent back so you can do your due diligence when you're looking for your new home and have some time and not feel rushed? What are those terms and conditions? Do they meet your current needs? And last but not least, keep the end goal in mind. It's to sell your home. If you had a bunch of showings but no offers, definitely consider this offer. But at the end of the day, keep in mind your end goal is to sell your home and the best way to do that is to consider all offers and try to work with them.